as part of efforts to address challenges facing the livestock industry. The African Union's Inter-Africa Bureau for Animal Resources, AU IBA, is consistent in the planning and implementation process of the African pastoral market development. The Minister of Livestock Development, Mukta Idi Meha, was optimistic that the project will bring innovative solutions into the livestock sector, as the federal government is ready to work with all relevant stakeholders to improve productivity. It is very optimistic that it will positively contribute to the growth and development of the livestock sector, which contributes about 30% of the rural economy and combined contribution of 10% to the country of the country's gross domestic product with the agricultural sector. This technical workshop has brought together stakeholders that have deliberated on priorities and modalities for the implementation of the project. Participants were urged to work towards realizing the full potential of African pastoral markets for the benefit of communities, economies and future generations. Nigeria is a lighthouse country, so we are leading a lighthouse country who should be leading the rest of the Sahel countries, which is an instrument in driving the implementation of African pastoral market development platform across the ECOWAS and Sahel region and even beyond. The initiatives will strengthen pastoral integration into livestock markets and the multi-stakeholder forum provided by the platform will increase coordination of action in the priority areas with the following pillars. Strengthening enabling, enabling policy environment and strategic implementation, then strengthening private sector integration into livestock markets. The African Union Inter-African Bureau for Animal Resources, AU IBA, project on the development of Africa pastoral markets targets trading corridors that include Nigeria, Burkina Faso, Niger Republic, Chad, and Cameroon with focus and objectives aimed to positively contribute to the growth and development of African livestock sector. Ngozi Onyejiaku, AIT News, Abuja.